So we have Anya here with her precious little one. And the testimony is actually of this little guy right here. So Anya, can you just tell us first, what was the problem uh, that you and your little guy here were experiencing? So about a month ago, uh, he started to break out on his face and he started to have a diarrhea, no, actually two months ago, and he started to have a severe diarrhea where it lasted about three weeks. Um, and the picture that's shown in here is just the beginning of the rash. But about a month ago, the rash was really severe where his skin was really red. It was very raw, almost to the point of bleeding. So me and my husband, when the rash started and the diarrhea wasn't going away, we went to the doctors. We started applying different creams, using different products, but it wasn't helping. So we first started um, praying with prayer, uh, anointing water. So we prayed for him because he was starting to be fussy. We sprayed anointing water on him. Uh, pray with anointing water, and then, so his area stopped, and he became very happy, but the rash did not go away. It actually started to get worse and worse. So last prayer line, we joined the prayer line. We prayed for him with a prayer line, um, and a week later, actually the Monday, it started to ease up, and uh, a week later, everything was completely gone, and he was completely clear. Amen. Let's put our hands together for Jesus. So, Anya, can you just tell us how old is your little guy here, and uh, for how long was he having that problem? He's three months old today, and the problem started when he was about three weeks old. So he started to have the diarrhea at three weeks old, and then at the, the rash started to develop at three weeks old. At first we thought it was allergy, um, baby acne, but then we took to the doctors because it kept progressing worse and worse, and the doctors like, it's allergies. So they st we started to um, eliminate things from my diet, eliminating, you know, different products, trying different things, and it was just not helping. So it lasted for about a month, and that's when we came to the prayer line. So after trying to figure it out, he's having this severe allergic reaction. You can't find the problem, and it's just getting worse and worse and worse. After you came to the prayer line last month, the very next day, this rash that wouldn't go away, that the doctors couldn't diagnose, started clearing up, and now it's gone today? Yes. Amen. Let's put our hands together for Jesus. And Tony, can you come close? I just want you to get a really good close-up of this little guy's face. You can see here the difference. Here is just the beginning of the rash, as she explained. This is just the beginning, and it began to cover his whole face. But now, if, uh, if you can put it up on the screen, you can see this little guy. See how happy he is and how completely clear his skin is today for the glory of God. Amen. Amen. So, Anya, what advice can you give to people whose children may be suffering? You know, your, your own son, who's just three months old, I can imagine how heartbreaking it was for you to see your little guy in all of this pain, and there's nothing that you could do about it. What can you uh, say to some other parents whose children may be sick or experiencing something? Um, in Second Kings, I believe it's Naaman, that um, he got prophesied to go and dunk himself in the water seven times. You know, in the, in the Bible, it doesn't say if he started to clear out the skin disease that he had, it started to clear out after the first dunk or second dunk. It took him seven times to get his healing. We started with anointing water. It helped some, but the rash was not going away, and we resorted to prayer line. We did not give up. So, you know, if you guys are suffering with things, diseases, don't give up. God does answer, and then God, God is on your side. Amen. Let's put our hands together one more time for Jesus. Thank you so much, Anna.